Hello, people. How are you? How's it going? What's the story? What's the crack? Here I am. And this time, I want to talk about the first semi-final and the countries I think will have more options to qualify. Game on. <laughs> Semi-final one will take place on the 10th of May and 17 countries are participating in this semi-final. As we all know, only 10 will qualify to the grand final. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to listen to the official recap in the running order of this first semi-final and then I'll have my thinking and let you know about which songs I think will have more options to qualify and which ones don't. <laughs> Well, that was it, the 17 songs participating in this first semi-final. So, uh, what I'm gonna do is I have uh, my two, almost three, sure, well not sure because we are not always sure, uh, non-qualifiers. In this case, I think uh, neither Slovenia nor Croatia will make it to the grand final. I don't think they have very uh, potent and important songs. So I think they will stay here in the semi-final. Uh, I might be wrong, and maybe they bring like a really nice stage in and they do like amazingly and they go through, but mm, they have really, really low chances from my point of view to qualify for the grand final. And the third one that I'm, uh, I don't think it will make it either is uh, Lithuania. Uh, a hell of a singer, she's really good, she's a performer, uh, but the song is just not it. I don't think the song is powerful enough. And Lithuania is before Switzerland, that is another ballad, and the ballad is more powerful than Lithuania's. Uh, I, I think they, they, they won't make it. Even the diaspora, the countries that are voting in this first semi-final, 
I don't think they will help them much either. So I think Lithuania will stay in the semis this time. That's my thinking. Then I have uh, four uh, sure qualifiers. First one for sure that will qualify is Ukraine. There's no doubt about it. It's one of the main favorites. It's first on the odds for winning the whole contest. They have a hell of a show. I, I, I did like I do like the song a lot, and I think they will they will do really good. So they will qualify for sure. Then we have uh, Netherlands. I think there are those are another sure qualifiers. I mean that they will qualify. They will qualify for sure. Then we have Greece, another of the favorites. Uh, she's really good singer. She's also a very nice song. So they will qualify for sure. And the fourth uh, country that will qualify for me, I think, is Norway. Norway is completely different. It's fresh. They have this. Uh, dance and everything and yeah it's not that the lyrics are what what they are but this is for fun and they are playing uh, so previous to last so I, I think they'll make it guys I think they, they are gonna people are gonna vote for this so I think that they'll go through even the Merck is there so they will get votes from their Merck and from Iceland the, the, the Nordic countries will get votes so I, I think they'll make it. Then, then I have two countries that, uh, mm, yeah, that mostly, mostly they are sure qualifiers. But it will all come to the performance, I think, and the staking. And these countries are the one that is opening the show and the one that is closing the show. Uh, Albania and Armenia. Albania has a hell of a song. And unless they do really bad in the staging or the performance, I think they are going to qualify. I think they have a good song and very potent, modern. I don't know. It's catchy. It's everything. So I think they will qualify as well. And then we have Armenia. Armenia last. Armenia is maybe not so sure as Albania. But I think the song is really good. I think this is a song that people will like, televoters. And I think this song, if it's passed through, will make it better in the in the grand final than in the semi-finals because of the type of the public that is watching it but i think it's good enough i mean and she has a hell of a voice it's really good we've seen the pre-parties uh, i don't know what type of staging they would bring but if they bring a really nice one i think they are also will qualify but i'm not so sure on this one anyway We'll see soon, uh, and after the rehearsals, we'll have a better idea of which one, if I change something of this list or not. Then we have, uh, I seen seven, nine countries, so we have eight countries yet to see which one will qualify of these eight countries. That's difficult to say. Uh, oof. These eight countries are going to fight for those uh, four spots. So 50% chances or they will, no, at least from my point of view, maybe one of the, the ones that I said already, I'm completely wrong. But I think the four countries that will get a spot in the final, yes, before rehearsals and before we know the stagings and everything, I'd say Switzerland. I think the song is, it's a ballad, nice ballad, nice voice, uh, juries will buy it. And yeah, and Televote will get some votes from the Televote as well. So I think they, they can qualify. Then I'd say uh, Bulgaria. I'd say Bulgaria not because of the song. I don't think the song is powerful enough. But because of the Bulgarian diaspora as well, I think they will get uh, some points there. Um, I don't know. It's going to tough for them, but... I think this voting from people from outside, Bulgarians outside from Bulgaria, I think they can make them qualify. It will be borderline qualifier, I say, and between Ukraine and Netherlands, I don't know. Then, then I say, I think Moldova. Moldova has a song that is very happy, very upbeat. And first time I listened to the song, I said, well, this is not as powerful as Bonica Batedova, but... Uh, I've seen them in the pre-parties and this is fun and people like it and I think this is going to the final as well. And then the fourth, 
I think it's going to be Austria. I don't know why, but Austria lifts your spirits up and makes you dance. And um, I don't know. I think Televot will get some from this and uh, probably the jury will vote them down. I don't know. That, that, that's when I chose, but pff, could be could be others. Could be the others. Because then we have Portugal, Denmark, Latvia and Iceland. Latvia is one of those complicated to say. I don't like the show, the song, but I do like the show. What will happen? I don't know if the jurors uh, will vote for this. That's that's why I didn't put them uh, qualifying. But could be. Then Portugal. Portugal, I, I'm in love with the Portuguese song. But it's tough. It's tough. It's, it's, this is the toughest semi-final. And uh, they're going to be borderline. I, I would be really happy if Portugal uh, qualifies. I, I wouldn't mind at all. I prefer Portugal qualifying than Bulgaria, for example. Denmark, Denmark and Iceland, no, are the ones that are missing. Denmark, well, it's not a bad song, but mm, I don't think it's powerful enough. And if it could, it could qualify because these countries are all together in the running order. We have Moldova, we have Portugal, then Croatia, and then Denmark and Austria and Iceland. So out of these five countries, it's, I think we'll qualify at least one of these countries. So I'd say Austria, but could be any other. And then Iceland. Iceland is just, I don't know, it's very nice. And the three the sisters I'm singing there, I do like them. So uh, I don't know guys, I tough, 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 really tough decision. But these are my 10 countries. We'll see soon which one I guessed and which was I didn't. Anyway, guys, uh, let me know which are your qualifiers in the comments below. Hit like if you liked the video, subscribe to the channel, notification bell button, and see you in the next video. Bye.